Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all well and welcome to Zolda in Belgium for round two of my DTM 2019 championships. Uh, I ran a qualifier, felt much better about the car this time and placed 8th out of 18. Uh, so let's get this underway. Uh, full 18 car grid, uh, good mix of AMGs, BMWs and Audis. And we're off. BMW next to me, I think. On the outside. Go up to turn two here. Take it in third. Oh, little bump. Cheeky Audi there. Take that spot back. So, um, a lot of people don't realise that Zolder is actually. Uh, it was actually the first purpose-built race circuit in Belgium. I haven't had a, a huge amount of experience racing here, um, but I do really like it. Um, some pretty cool things about Zolder. Uh, there's oh, yellow flag. There is uh, two very cool oh, elevation changes that are both on corners, so it puts the car off balance. We were jostling through there. So that was the first one, obviously, that went through um, through the first chicane. And then this one just here, right before we come up to a hairpin. I feel I've got the um, the brakes locked down a little bit better than I did last race. Um, and the other two, the other the other thing about Zolder is it's it's actually quite unique in the fact that it has three sets of chicanes. Um, oops, spin behind me. So the one behind us uh, that we just went through is uh, Jackie X, uh, coming through Ernst, Ernst now, the first corner. Um, let's see if I can catch up to these guys. They're jostling ahead, so it might give me a chance. Quite a few cool high speed corners here. So uh, this, this, this chicane just here is um, Klein, quite a high speed chicane, jostling ahead again. This here is Villeneuve. Of spaces now, which is good. Oh, total brain fade there. Ooh, a little bit light on the brakes. Make sure I don't lock it up. So um, for this setup, I feel a lot more comfortable than I did um, the last round from Hockenheim. Brakes are still a little bit touchy, as you can see, but um, nowhere near what they were at Hockenheim. So I've uh, reduced the braking power and also reduced the um, and moved the um, the brake balance back. I'm being a little bit too delicate there. Ground up, yeah, I think we are. So there's no way I could have broke, um, braked like that at the last round. Still want to kick out a little bit, so I could probably make some more adjustments. But um, much happier with the way the car feels here. I also adjusted the um, slow bump, slow bump rebound, fast and fast rebound. And uh, a little bit higher downforce than the, the default, so I think about 18 degrees, or 18 on the, the setting itself. 
preloads dropped all the way down as it was at the last round too though. Which is important I guess considering these cars have no traction control whatsoever. Still seems to be pulling away though. Seems to be much quicker than me through the second half of the circuit. Oh, that was very cheeky. So just six laps here. Um, Zolder's four kilometres long, although it doesn't it doesn't feel that way because it's such a fast flowing circuit lap lap comes up pretty quickly when I mean, you're doing 128 around that they can break it way too early there The uh, brake adjustments definitely feel like they're working. I'm not, I've not got any, f any flat spots, so well, I wouldn't say there's uh, super heavy braking points like there are at Hockenheim. to the, uh, the mod again and also this version of this version of Zolder. I don't know if there are any other versions for R Factor 2. It's a pretty cool layout though. It's a pretty um, pretty accurate one. Especially compared to something like um, the laser scan version in ACC. It's pretty close. There are a couple of little inconsistencies though, I think some of the 100 metre um, braking markers aren't quite 100 metres. Here we go, last lap. A pretty clean race. It's a pity that we, uh, we couldn't stick with that forward pack. quick through this section. Zold is a circuit that feels um, excellent when you get a nice flow going. Very smooth circuit, very feels rewarding. If you get it right. And we're across the line. That was a pretty cool race. No real issues. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, um, give it a like. Uh, Subscribe and hit the notification bell and I'll be sure to upload more content soon. Thanks guys. Bye